Yeah, probably one of the most important NSFW warnings on any of the videos. Um, so, <laughs> this game contains depictions of penises and penetration. It features penis-based combat, where one is trying to insert the head of one's penis into the bum of another penis uh, located just behind the balls of said penis. So, um, possibly not safe for your workplace. If this is safe for your workplace, I would love to hear about where you work uh, in the comments below. John took a moment to stare into the void of his own existence. The painkillers swirled. Finally, John could flop about freely. Hello and welcome to the video and well done for making it this far. Today we are going to be featuring a game from Devolver Digital, also well known for their classic games such as Hotline Miami and Broforce. Today we're looking at genital jousting. Oh boy, I am sure this is the video that is going to ensure the future success of the channel. And in a desperate attempt to justify this video, uh, this video's existence, we will be making a part of a series called Wacky, Weird or Wonderful. See, each word begins with W, just like good guys gaming, so it's clever. You see, you get that? It's clever, okay. So if the game is wacky, we'll say, maybe it's worth it if it's on sale, and probably only for novelty value, or for a laugh. Uh, if it's weird, well, it's just weird, and you decide if it's worth your time, and maybe your money. And if it's wonderful, it's it's a good game, and it's worth buying, even though it's featured in this um, terrible playlist. Okay, let's take a look at this wonderful title screen. You can, of course, play offline. You can play with yourself if you want. <laughs> you can do online multi peen, which is multiplayer but with penises. And there are some options to look at as well. Uh, an interesting one here is you can unlock everything right from the start. So there are unlocks in the game that you earn by playing and, and leveling up. These are basically cosmetic items for your penis, such as a. Uh, I don't know, a tuxedo or mini skirt or even a Prince Albert, if that's your thing. You can unlock those straight away right from the start. You can also clear those unlocks if you want to go back to earning them. And graphics wise, the options are simple. You can set your resolution and you can have a windowed mode or not. So looking at multiplayer mode, which is where all the action is at. You can see it starts off in a very sensible way. You need to hold up the consent. This is the type of situation where everybody needs to consent. I'm going to consent. And you automatically get a name you don't get to pick, so I'm Randy the Yellow Penis. Here we go. So this is the lobby. This is where we wait for a game. I'm using keyboard at the moment because I'm recording. However, I highly recommend for optimal penis control to use a controller. So to begin we need to choose an open slot and let's go. Penetrate each other to spray. Oh! Butthole! But, 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 don't leave me out! Oh, no! Get, get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Oh! Oh my god! Ah, uh, this is... 
This is like what Nintendo wanted Splatoon to be like. <laughs> oh dear, I just don't want to get involved. So, uh, okay, you need to penetrate uh, to refill your spunk ability and then, yes, you need to spray, 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 oh. Well, of course it does. Lube Luge, race to the end. This is brilliant. This mode is great. This is tremendous. Go. Go, 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 go. Don't touch the signs. Don't touch the signs. Uh, whoa. Yeah, no. No. Okay. Okay. Second place. Second place, second place, second place, second place, second place, second place. Come on, come on, come on, don't fight me. Time the best penis. Yes! <laughs> Double delight to his company. Oh, I, I know this game. So the goal in this one is to get the dildo into both of your a-holes, but somebody always gets left out. This one I don't know what we need to do. Form a ring. Oh, we need to penetrate each other? Is it? Is it? Oh. Well, I, uh, I was left out again. Don't fuck anything. Abstinence. So we need to make sure not to get something in our butthole along the way. And the other two screwed up because they got each other in their butthole. So now I can win unopposed, get the head in the ring, get the head in the ring, just like the wedding day. Oh, oh, come on, come on, beautiful, beautiful. Winning, winning penis. First place. First place. Thank you very much. And I'm the best penis. I'm the best cock. Okay, so... Let's start a game. I ain't gonna change my... Oh, they're leaving. Why? Because I beat you so much? I was a good penis. Mm hmm. Let's just not comment on that outfit. Wow. That is probably my favorite penis outfit. Uh, tuxedo is a good one as well. Don't know what that is. Alternate tuxedo. Well, you can't go wrong with a dog collar and a strappy top, of course. Good music, huh? I am bopping right now. Degrees. Yes. Come on. How is that not the best penis outfit? Whoa. Oh, yeah. Oh, check that out. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm doing this video. So, as we can see, the game has you in control of a dismembered penis and tasks you with your fighting against other penises in an attempt to penetrate them in the butt or trying out various party games where you need to get your penis uh, to perform a certain task, uh, such as sliding down a nice luge track or navigating a thorny field of roses. Um, there's also a date night mode as well, which you're seeing in the background here. From what I can tell, all of the members are flaccid and flexible, and movement seems to be aided uh, by some form of dick sweat, which we all know is one of nature's most efficient lubricants. Uh, there's also an aim assist, so once you're looking towards an enemy butthole, when you're close enough, your schlong will pop right in there. So what is the verdict? Well, the game is currently priced at €4.99 Euro on Steam and has ratings that are very positive. 
and although it would have been very easy for the developers and publisher to just see this as kind of a joke title and a bit of a throwaway game in fact they are updating it and releasing new content the date night mode you're viewing at the moment was the latest update to the game on the 13th of february and that introduced six new activities uh to be able to partake in so the game is getting updates the uh steam reviews are also pretty hilarious to read as well uh, there is a pretty active community but the reviews are full of good ideas uh, such as introducing a new helicopter mode people commenting that playing playing by yourself this game is weird so what is the final verdict wacky weird or wonderful well this game is more than just a joke game it features some funny stuff for sure uh, but the mechanics are well thought out uh, it has genuine replayability and it doesn't cost a lot of money and with so much cr other crap on Steam especially on Greenlight I think that this is actually going to be rated wonderful so I do recommend checking it out and seeing what you think if you for some reason enjoyed this video and all of those penises on screen please do like and subscribe to the channel for more wacky weird or wonderful stuff in the future thank you very much